Hey defenders, welcome back to our channel. Today we are tackling a question that has been on the minds of many cryptocurrency communities. Especially this particular question, will quantum computing kill bitcoins? If you are also looking for the answer for this question, let's dive right in. To start, what exactly is quantum computing? In traditional computers, we use bits to process information. These bits can either process a zero or a one. Think of them like a tiny light switch, right? That can either be switched on or switched off, right? Now, quantum computers take this concept to an altogether different new level. With quantum, you have nothing called bits. Instead, you have something called qubits. It's Q-U-B-I-T-S, qubits. Here is where it actually gets super exciting, thanks to the principle called superposition. Qubits can represent both 0 and 1 at the same time, and that is why it's called the superposition. It's 0 position or 1 position, right, usually, but this is 0 position and 1 position at the same time. This allows quantum computers to perform calculations at lightning speed. For example, a problem that could take an enormous number of classical bits uh, like 2 power 500 could be solved effortlessly by a quantum computer with just 500 qubits. Think of that, right? It is like you going in a cycle versus you going in a Japan's ultra fast uh, bullet train, right? It's that kind of a comparison. But that is definitely some serious computing power, isn't it? Now, why does this actually matter for Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies? Well, the cryptocurrency methods that keep Bitcoin secure could be at risk from powerful com quantum computing perspective. Why? Because using an algorithm called Shor's algorithm, a sufficiently advanced quantum computer can potentially crack Bitcoin's crypto encryption uh, in just a matter of say 10 minutes if it had around 1.9 billion qubits. Think of that. A cryptocurrencies encryption can actually be, not cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin, specifically I'm talking about Bitcoins. Bitcoin's encryption can just be cracked in under 10 minutes if you had around 1.9 billion qubits. That sounds pretty scary, right? But before you start worrying and selling your Bitcoins, let's take a deep breath and uh, let me tell you this technology isn't here yet currently the most advanced quantum computers are still in development recently ibm unveiled 433 qubit processor if you remember this particular number it is very much similar to the 433 megahertz celeron processor isn't it right so this ibm's 433 qubit processor right is one of the fastest processors there is and now they are actually planning to release a thousand qubit uh, model very soon right experts like cryptographer Gens Groth believe that while the threat is real we may not face significant risk for another 10 to 20 years now let's talk about qubits once again there are two types of qubits that one should know. One, physical qubit. Two, logical qubits. Physical qubits are quite unstable and can make mistakes easily. To get reliable results, scientists combine several physical qubits to create what we call the logical qubits. But don't panic. There are uh, ways to defend against these kind of quantum threats. Blockchain developers can actually today adapt cryptographic keys to stay one step ahead of quantum computers. For instance, they can increase the key size to make it much harder for quantum machines to crack, right? It is kind of like building thicker walls around your uh, important castle or your bank. You, you have a lot of defenses in place before you actually reach your most critical assets, right? You have firewall, antivirus, anti-malware, so many defenses before you actually touch the critical asset. Now, one exciting area for research today is called the lattice-based cryptography. What is lattice-based cryptography? 
this method adds mathematical noise that could actually confuse even the most powerful quantum computers think of this right and uh, making it difficult for them to solve problems quickly it is giving them a complex puzzle they just can't crack having said that upgrading bitcoin's encryption isn't as simple as flipping a switch right since bitcoin is decentralized convincing every single node across the world right uh, to adopt new encryption protocol is quite challenging that's the truth that that's a hard truth so will quantum computers ultimately kill bitcoins let me tell you while they do pose a significant threat for now bitcoin remains secure at least until we see a major advancement in the quantum computing technology as we look ahead it's crucial for developers to stay sharp and proactive in fortifying bitcoin against this future challenge if you found this video interesting don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights into this fascinating world of cryptocurrency cybersecurity and technology until then see you next time thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe for more tech insights on cybersecurity